Back in the mid-1990s, three young Jewish women in the Bay Area realized they could no longer keep silent about Israel's brutal occupation of Palestinians. And they went looking for a political home where they could speak out. But they didn't find one, so they decided to build their own. They started meeting in people's living rooms, and before long, there was a committed community of people that were ready to take action. It was out of those living room meetings that Jewish Voice for Peace was born. And in 2001, in the midst of the Second Intifada, things really began to take off. And that's when I felt compelled to join. We raise our voices proudly as Jews fighting for Palestinian human rights. We keep our values at the core of everything we do. And we live out those values by taking fierce, bold action. I'm Jewish. I support Palestinian human rights. A lot has changed since then. We've become a national organization. We have more than 70 chapters all around the country. We have several hundred thousand supporters online. And we're still meeting in living rooms, but we're also filling auditoriums. Our actions have spread across the country. We span every generation. And our partnerships only deepen. And it's working. We're strong enough that we can hold our representatives accountable. We can push corporations to divest from occupation and apartheid. We're organizing on campuses. We're shifting culture. We're keeping our communities honest and accountable. And we're building across movements. We believe, just like we did back then, that true safety comes through solidarity. And we know that it will take all of us to make the change that we want to see. We're helping to build a broad-based movement for Palestinian rights and a Jewish community that supports it. Together for freedom. Join us.